guys, so today I'm going to be reacting to funny teachers who know how to deal with students. So yeah, let's just get right into the video. Friend of mine's math teacher responds to a doodle he drew on his test. Almost free. You shall not pass. <laughs> it's actually like you shall not pass. Oh. What does the teacher mean though? What does the teacher actually mean? Like as in you just won't pass or you won't actually pass the test? <laughs> oh, this teacher is savage. <laughs> Dear students, I know when you're texting in class, seriously, no one just looks down at the crotch and smiles. <laughs> I swear, it's so obvious when someone is texting in class because they'll just be doing this. <laughs> but hey, what if some people are actually just smiling at the crotch? You never know. <laughs> what if they are just impressed by their own crush, okay? <laughs> this teacher knows everything. This teacher knows. Josh Hans, for most homeworks go missing. <laughs> he got an award because most of his homeworks go missing. <laughs> that excuse though, like, oh yeah, I forgot my homework. Oh no, my dog ate my homework. Oh no, yeah, today I left my bag in the train, so I lost my bag, so no homework. <laughs> So many excuses, too many excuses. Homework, please do one of the following by Tuesday. One, master kung fu. Master Kung Fu. <laughs> I don't know. Why, why do I have to master Kung Fu again? Two, switch religions for a day. Three, wear a fake moustache for 24 hours. Four, end world hunger. Five, find your nemesis, earn their trust, then vanquish them. Preferably with magic. <laughs> Wait, what is this homework? <laughs> Six, in the shower, use conditioner first and then shampoo. Just see what would happen. I'm curious. What? <laughs> that is gonna be so life changing. Conditioner and then shampoo? What the heck? <laughs> that is so weird. Oh my gosh. It's like life turning upside down. <laughs> this teacher is just amazing. Why does this teacher seem so fun? My microbiology professor did the entire lecture like this. <laughs> What? <laughs> oh my gosh, this is amazing. This teacher is amazing. How is this teacher so awesome? During their break, students discover what the teacher is drinking. Students' tears. <laughs> the teachers are happy when the students are crying. Oh, is that what the teachers live off? The students' misery? I see. I see how it is. How my teacher describes the scientific process. Observation. Questioning. Hypothesis. Prediction. Experiment. Result. <laughs> the memes. I love all of these memes. This is actually really smart though because now people communicate with memes. The only thing I need in life is memes. So just talk to me in memes. <laughs> Impress me. Why? Plus four. Good. Always question the man. <laughs> the teacher gave the student four marks. Oh, bless this teacher. This teacher is too nice. Give me an A on the teddy bear gets it <laughs> the teacher actually drew the teddy bear dead oh see <laughs> oh my gosh and the teacher gave the student a C <laughs> this teacher is such a savage oh my gosh <laughs> the poor teddy bear what did the teddy bear do he asked the teacher for a pen <laughs> is that one of those ink pens oh my gosh I want to try and use one of those that is so cool but hey at least now you will never lose that pen and you will remember to give it back <laughs> Seriously though, once you let someone borrow your pen, it goes missing. It's just gone forever. At least this pen won't ever go missing. Please accept this man dolphin in return for any wrong answers. Because of this outstanding man dolphin, everyone got four points. Well done. <gasps> what? Everybody in the class got four points? Why don't I have this teacher? Why don't I have this teacher? <laughs> this teacher is so amazing. And this student, thank you for drawing this dolphin and giving everyone four points. How is this teacher so nice? How have I never met any of these nice teachers before? My English teacher put this on the clock during finals. How clever. Time is passing. Are you? <laughs> Time is passing. But are you passing? Are you really passing this course? <laughs> That's just sad. That's honestly so sad. But I feel like I need to look at the time during exams. Why did the teacher cover the clock? <laughs> oh no, that's honestly gonna make me so paranoid because I don't know how much time I have left. Late assignments. <gasps> In the bin? Oh no. That is one savage teacher. <laughs> the teacher is just like, I'm not accepting late assignments, so put them in the bin if it's late. <laughs> What if you were actually late? Oh, that is just sad. This teacher decided to attach job applications for McDonald's to the failed testers. <gasps> that is just mean. Okay, that is so mean. What? Okay, that is not nice. That is honestly not nice. Just because someone got F doesn't mean they can't do better. They can do better. People improve. People change. That is so not nice. <laughs> okay, this is just poor mean. It's okay, guys. If you guys have ever gotten a low score, it's okay. There's room to improve and there's room to practice. You will do better. It's okay. Just believe in yourself and practice and do better. Principal thinks of a genius fundraiser. $1 for a piece of tape. <laughs> oh my gosh, they actually taped him to a wall. That is cool. <laughs> I would totally pay money to tape the principal to the wall. <laughs> 
the principal looks like he's actually regretting everything. He's just like, why did I do this? Why did I suggest to do this? But hey, at least on the bright side, it's going to charity, okay? That is good. If you wanted a grade, that should have put your name on it. <laughs> I remember one teacher who had a name that was really hard to spell and he gave people one mark for people who could spell his name correctly on the test because people would normally just shorten his name and they would actually never know his full name. <laughs> so yes, that was amazing. This teacher likes hashtags. Hashtag YOLO. Hashtag minimum wage. Hashtag future. Hashtag McDonald's. <laughs> This teacher just got him back. <laughs> At least the teacher played along, right? <laughs> Physics teacher explains what liquids are. Cats are liquids. Liquids take the shape of the container while maintaining a constant volume. That's it. So cats are liquids. <laughs> How did cats fit in everything? I've seen this cat fit in a small jar and I was like, well, now how are you going to get out? How? <laughs> Cats honestly just fit in everything. It's just so funny. This math teacher solves for x -mas. <laughs> The smirk, the teacher smirk is like, I got you guys. I got you guys. Merry Christmas, guys. <laughs> that is so nice. This is so creative as well. This already just gives me a headache. <laughs> How to write an essay by me. I'm about to save your lives, Ephes. <laughs> Wait, a professor wrote that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, at least we know we're gonna learn, right? This is gonna be real. Today is gonna be a real lesson. <laughs> I hope this wasn't as depressing to grade as it was to take it. Pretty much was. <gasps> it was depressing to grade. Oh, roasted. <laughs> Chuck is a serial killer. <laughs> a serial killer. Oh my gosh, did the teacher actually draw a drawing of someone trying to kill a serial? <laughs> Why won't you die already? Yes, killing and stabbing the serial. <laughs> Cheerios, the poor Cheerios. The teacher grading this. Crap, 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 crap. <laughs> well, that's really reassuring to look at. Imagine if you saw that on the teacher's desk and you're gonna be like, oh no, I failed. <laughs> yeah, that's just sad. Well, that's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Tell me in the comments down below which one was your favorite. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!